And a pivot crossing without the ladder system on the fence there. It pushes the wires out a fair way. Which, once you've got the ladder on there, it's restricted. It can't push it out as far. And it helps pull the wires down underneath the irrigator. The wire now is pushed out a long way from the fence. This is a ladder crossing point which is part of the Shoreflex fencing system. On this fence we installed the um, Shoreflex springs down the other end and now we've come along here and I've started the crossing point, we've got that end done and we'll just go through the doing this end. So you drill your holes using a 5mm bit at the top of the alka thing. Put it to the side so it misses the wire. Now that's ready, yep. I'm going to use the strain right 4mm nylon wire that was specifically designed for fencing. We thread it up through the alkathene and as we do we put the 5mm crimps. To, when we're threading it through, pull it over. So we want the wire, when we come back down it's going to loop over here and the wire is, falls in between the nylon wire. So it's important to get it on the right side so each time you thread it through just pull, this, pull the alkathene over so we get the wire on the right side of it. Once you've gone through that bottom one, thread on two of the 5mm crimps. There, two more crimps. Pull it through, leaving enough to tie off down the bottom there. Now we loop it over the top so it's going to catch that wire and thread it back down through the crimps. Slide that up, just just these, get them ready to crimp. Check this, that the wire spacings are right, that you haven't pulled the wires together, and we can start crimping those ones. When you're crimping, if you, you don't crimp right to the end, so if you leave it so it's just flared a little bit, so there's no sharp edge there on the nylon wire. Let's take it up towards the top. And 
two crimps of the tool will be sufficient to hold it. Let's move it down a little bit on that crimp. And now we'll put this short length of waratah in the ground um, to anchor this to. So when the centre pivot hits it, it helps pull the wires down and under. We make a staple out of some 4mm wire. Thread the wire through and it means that when this is anchored, that the wire will be, it's metal to metal there. So it won't wear out like it would if you put it through the nylon cable. So the formula Y just comes to the top of the crimp. That can be crimped right to the end because we're going to cut out that bit of protruding nylon. That means now when that wheel comes to go over and it pushes on there, it can only go out so far, which helps pull, it, pull the fence down and under the wheel. The irrigator is about to cross over that ladder system now. And notice that that top wire is already pulling, it pulls it down quite quickly because it can't um, push it outwards and helps fold it down and under for the wheel to come on. The alkathene also protects the wire from rubbing on the steel pipe all the time. And when the wheel crosses it, it's means it's not shorting out on the ground either 